Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nikki LaRose. If I had only five minutes to do my makeup in the morning, this is exactly what I would do. This is a great go-to makeup look and I'll be using some of my personal favorite products that I grab almost daily for a quick, simple makeup look. Grabbing my phone, I'm gonna set my timer for five minutes so you can see that I'm doing this in real time. I'll be using the Dermablend CC Cream. This has SPF 50 in it and it's got a great amount of coverage. I'm gonna take this with a damp beauty blender and just dab it all over my face, starting in the center, just to even out my complexion. Next, I'm grabbing my favorite concealer. This is the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Macadamia. For me, this is my top priority because I do have dark circles under my eyes, so I'm taking this and I'm concealing right underneath my eye. This product is so well loved, the label is completely rubbed off, but it's one of my favorite cream blushes. I'll be using this on my cheekbones, on my lips, and a little bit on my eyelids. First, I'm swiping this on my cheeks for a quick application, then taking my beauty blender and just dabbing it in to blend. Using whatever's left over in my beauty blender, I'm dabbing that straight onto my eyelids just for a little wash of color. Cream products are definitely my go-to when I'm trying to get my makeup done fast. This one's a cream highlighter from Girl Lactic in Moonlight. I'll be using the same damp beauty blender to dab this on the cheekbones, the bridge of the nose, and the high points of my face. Another priority for me personally is setting my makeup, so I'm grabbing the Loose Veil Powder from Hourglass. I'll be applying this with my damp beauty blender and press it under my eye to set my concealer so it does increase throughout the day. I'll also be dabbing this on the center of my forehead just to cut down some of the shine. Another great way to save time on your makeup application is using your bronzer as your eyeshadow. So I'll be grabbing one of my favorites. This is the NARS Laguna Bronzer. I'm sweeping this across my forehead, along the sides of my cheeks, across my nose to warm up my skin, and then as my eyeshadow.
Here's where I got a little ahead of myself. I grabbed one of my favorite eye pencils. This one's Teddy from MAC. It's a beautiful, rich, dark brown liner. This is such a beautiful bronzy eye pencil. I use this all the time, especially for a daytime look. I'll be attempting to trace this along my lash line to create a small little winged effect. On to mascara, this is another one of my go-tos. I will not leave my house without my brows done or mascara. This one's from Bite, it's the Upswing Mascara. You can see that just one coat of this mascara is really making a huge difference on my lashes. Moving on to another one of my priorities and that is filling in my eyebrows. At the moment, my brows are laminated, so it's actually saving me a ton of time when filling them in. So I really only need a little bit of this pencil. Lastly, the final step in my not so five minute makeup tutorial is setting my makeup with the Milk Hydro Grip Set and Refresh Spray. So here's my final makeup look. So clearly I missed the five minute mark. This was a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. I thought for sure I was going to nail this and have time left to spare. One lesson I did learn was trying to apply a perfect little brown wing liner with that pencil. That was definitely too ambitious took up a lot of my time. But other products that I use, I think were great multi-purpose products, like the powder bronzer that I use, you'll notice I used it to warm up my face, to slightly contour my cheeks, and I also use it as my eyeshadow. So that's like one of my best tips and one of my favorite tips is grabbing a nice bronzer, use it on your face and your eyes as your eyeshadow, you cannot go wrong with that. Another great time-saving multi-purpose product that I love and I actually use on a regular basis in the morning is my cream blush. I pop that on my cheeks, dab it in with my beauty blender, then I dab the excess on my eyelid, onto my lips, and that was just a great time-saving, easy, multi-purpose product that I highly recommend if you're in a time crunch. I think the biggest takeaway for this tutorial is just learning how to prioritize what's most important to you. For me personally, it was definitely concealing my under eyes and getting a little bit of mascara on and some brow color on, but it's gonna be different for everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.